Here we go. All right, now's the time. The big announcement day is here. What is it? You people on Facebook, I am not pregnant. Although that quit, gave us a great laugh. Quit. I may look it, but we're not, I'm not. No, stop being funny. Well, Thomas Rhett said it all right there. Ain't it funny how life changes? Uh, change is not easy. And after 14 and a half years, I have decided to take a step back from the Q Morning crew. This is not a, dece a decision that I came to lightly or quickly. Uh, the, you know, the schedule has been wearing on me for quite a few years now. It's, it's a tough grind to keep up with. I don't even know how to not be a part of this or if I can be successful doing something else. And legit, guys, I already have FOMO. Like, seriously, I fear missing out. But what I do know for sure is that this schedule and the grind of getting up at 4 a.m. for almost 15 years has just really burned me out. And I feel like my family gets the worst of me a lot of days because I'm tired and cranky. And, you know, this pandemic has tested us all. We've all been tested through this. And I think I've been spread as thin as I could possibly be spread this year. The kids doing homeschool, worrying about their emotional well-being, trying to balance all of that and coming here every day has been a real struggle for me. And there's been a lot going on in my mind and in my heart that I didn't let everyone see. So I have a great job opportunity that I'm excited about. I swore I was going to get through this. Ah, okay. Um, I've accepted a job with a technology company as part of their marketing team. And y'all, I am scared to death, but I'm excited to start a new chapter. Dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it, JD, get it together. Okay. No, really though, I'm excited to have a normal schedule. And when I told my kids, my teenager, Claire, she hugged me so hard and so tight. She said, I am so proud of you, mom. And I'm so excited that you're going to be home with us. You know, I've missed mornings. I missed sending yeah. them off to school and fixing them breakfast and things like that. And, and she's only got five more years. You know, she's only got five more years at home. Um, and I've realized the more activities they have, the older they get, you know, those things are going to be at night and on the weekends. And I want to be present for those things, not present as in just there, but I want to be present with them, you know? Um, so I want you guys to know this was my decision. And when this process started, I kept saying, God, if you're going to keep opening these doors for me, I'm going to keep walking through them. So here we are. Um, and here's, here's the thing that I'm not going away completely. I'm going to be doing some weekends. So you'll still hear me. And while they're looking for my replacement, Heather Davis will be filling in. Y'all are used to yeah. say Heather being in here while I'm on vacation. Um, my last day as part of the Q Morning Crew is going to be next Friday, March the 26th. Um, I'm not going to get into goodbyes and all that mess because I really will start blubbering then. But um, Willis and Captain Dave, I love y'all to death. I'm super appreciative of y'all's support. Um, and actually everybody here at QDR Support, Mad Dog, Heather, Brittany, our sales team, management, everybody. Everybody understands why I've come to this decision and how hard it's been for me. So I want to say thank you for allowing me to be part of the QDR family for all these years. You're going to be missed. You're like my bratty little sister. I know, that you never wanted, but you got anyway. Um. <laughs> <laughs> and right. Ca Captain Dave can attest that this job is mentally and physically draining. I, I'm actually 29 years old. Right, I know. I've aged at least I, 20 it, years. It is like, it's almost like being president or something. You, you really... It's mentally draining, and uh, I, I'm shocked you made it this far. Mm -hmm. And I'm very proud of you. And I'm Thank miss you. you. I, I miss you too. I love you very much. I love you too.